All right, I'm at Jumbo, the same one from before, with the fans down there, the ceiling fans. Well, I'm not gonna be showing those ones because they're exactly the same. The four fan lineup always changes it up and people buy those more, so they can afford them more. This KDK pedestal fan is one that I might want to be getting someday for my bedroom, or I might be getting one that has the blue blades, the pedestal version. The only good thing about the blue blade one is um. It looks more vintage and it'll have this sort of cover on it. The better thing about this one is plastic, it won't rust up. Well, the blades are plastic. And even though I don't like the, I like the other center piece better than this one. This one doesn't rust up, won't like lose the coloration. So I'm thinking this might be what I replaced the Honeywell with. You know, it matches pretty good with the bedroom walls. It looks somewhat modernish, I guess. And I'm fine with that. It works well, so that's really what matters to me. But I just don't see the blue one all that much, the postal version. So, um, yeah. And there's some more fans over here. And these are the KK table fans. And these other KK spells. So I actually prefer to get this one to my room, but the only thing is, I'm not, I don't, I don't like that stand on it. I do like the coloration on this one a little bit. Well, I think the white one will look a little bit better to give more contrast to the room. I mean, it doesn't really blend in too much. It kind of stands out more, so that's better. I will match the fan above. I can start in the bedroom. I'm not sure the other one see over here. They moved some stuff around since I was here last, a few weeks ago. More of them over here. Some some stores they have certain KDK models and so some of them don't. Some of them they sell all of them. This one seems to only carry a few of them. But um, yeah, they have a ton of universals. And there's all of them in there. But um, yeah, let me know what you guys think. If I should get like, not this version, put it in the stand. But I think they used to have something like that with this type of stand on it, or a square shaped one. But I'm thinking about getting like one like this. The only thing I'm not too big on is the blades, for they're see-through. If they had more of a bluish tint one, I'd probably be more into it. The only thing I do know, I think this one's a little bit cheaper than the blue one. I don't remember how, I don't remember how much the blue one was sold for. So um, yeah. The only, I remember that I see a lot, most of the blue ones that have the timer on it. If I can find one that doesn't have a timer, I'll probably be getting that one. So, um, yeah. A few more over here. Oh. Also, they put up another fan. Well, not a new ceiling fan, but they have another, like, four fan in action over here. Oh, they have some of those euros on this side. We have the Connex wall fan there. And there's the industrial one there. And now there's this one right here as well. The wind machine. So um yeah, let me know what you guys think. If you think that would be uh, that fan would look good in my room. Ooh, some spray paint. Nothing good though. But um yeah. Just giving this cup load just for work. Want one with the hand on. I figured, you know what, might as well get one down here since they don't overprice them like they do up in the United States. So you can find this one's like maybe 10 bucks. Not a bad deal. So, um, yeah. Model number on this one is P41U. I don't know, if, maybe if I even get this, I might paint the blades white on it. Who knows? Um, yeah, well, that'll be it for this video. Thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed and stay tuned for more videos to come.